I don't know, that kind of stuff is miserable to me. I just have no desire to spend that long trying to micro-optimize something. I would rather just play the game. It's a pretty good game. I am objectively here because I want to play it. I guess it's just biased cog. The middle? Or not the middle? We we'll probably get here and decide. And if we could calculate the lowest possible score in a spreadsheet, I mean... I mean... That's just cruel. Have I ever thought of playing a Slay the Spire mod? Was boss relic swap the worst on defect? I have not boss relic swapped in like three years or something. I do not enjoy boss relic swapping. I'm gonna take a charge battery. I, think I used to take more of these bridge cards on defect and then I stopped. Transform a strike? Probably. Sunder is like a big strike. They made a sweet video about boss swapping. Did I really? No recollection of doing that. Okay, though. Would have been a good vulnerable potion, maybe. I think. I think it just dies. The I think we're in one of the situations where it just dies after attacking twice before it attacks a third time. I was right. Oh no, our low HP build. It's all gone wrong. Halo Lord says boss swapping on Charles Lightning is quite good. That's probably true. I don't know. I prefer playing the characters leaning more into their mechanics, and I feel like boss swapping stops you from doing that. It does such I don't enjoy it very much. Your damage super elite grumble knob is defect, not bad. I did use two potions. I upgrade its defrag and sunder? Biased gone. Oh okay. yeah. Ooh, that's a good relic. A long, long time ago, I tried boss relic hopping on defect, and then it wasn't very enjoyable, so I stopped. <laughs> the problem is, sometimes you just, like, get Runic Pyramid on floor zero, and then you have to sit through the run for the next hour when you have already won. 
Infection is made better or worse by symbiotic virus. I don't actually know. I'm going to take it. Probably a symbiotic virus makes it either better or worse, you could say. I think it makes the upgrade better. I think that's true. Yes, or Pandora's box. It is very boring to swap into Pandora's box. In my opinion. In my opinion. I'm sure some people are into that. Kind of like um, at the start of the run, randomizing which difficulty you're flying on. When like, I would just like to play on Ascension 20. That's why I selected it, you know. Darkness. I think so. The darkness upgrade is also a bit better because of the symbiotic virus. It's a rare chance. It's not that high. I just got a fish in. I think a question mark then. Ooh, okay. Ooh, okay. That logic, Relic Swap is the only way to play Ascension greater than 20. Yeah, I mean, when you get a bad boss relic swap, it really is not great for for your chance to win the run. It's Flex Potion Sunder. I don't want it to be a Flex Potion Sunder, though. I would like it to be something else. I think it's just Flex Potion Sunder. Ah, uh, Yeah, I think so. It's not like it's an incredible Flex Potion. So the Prime Pronath! Not weak this time. I don't know that the Dark Orb does anything.
Okay, cool. Or surge with biased cog, usually pretty good. Runic pyramid with uh, slay the spire, usually pretty good. RNG fix seems like an excellent mod. RNG fix just always gives you pyramid after act one. Yep, that's that's how it is fixed. Apparently. Uh, 1342. Cool had it. I think so. Oh, shit. When I looked at the shop the first time, I assumed this was um, Mirror, but then I realized that there's Gambling Chip Defrag, which is maybe better. Missing a 50 gold card remove, kind of bad though. How does it feel having a Runic Pyramid? Pretty good. It's a pretty good relic. That's a decent one, to be honest. What do I mirror? Biased cop? Is that even right? Uh, I think this deck gets to a point where I can just actually remove three cards in my next four floors. I think it gets to a point where I don't really need gambling chip anymore. And I think I'm actually not even buying mirror. I think this is an incredibly strong store which I am buying defragment out of and then leaving. Well, defragment and card remove. Which was not what I thought I was doing when I entered the store. But Smiling Mask is just really good here, so... Meteor Strike? Probably not. Now I can buy the boot. Truly, my fortune has improved. Uh, I mean, this was kind of the idea, but there is an apotheosis as well now. Is it ever? I don't think so. Is it card remove or glacier? All right, cool. Those are some decent floors for my deck, I would say. I think I don't play efficient yet. I think I just tank 24. This feel kind of bad. So I don't think this is your potion. I think I saved that for sleevers, perhaps.
maybe an Alice Sphere Potion. Can I just block? I can just block, yeah. Gambling chip could have prevented all the damage. Where was gambling chip? When the thingamajig wants it. Do I want to send her now, or do I want Pendib on seven or eight, or eight or nine rather? Probably nine. I can't tell. A red shirt. Thanks for the 67 months. I appreciate it. Um, kind of painful to use vulnerable pot for one damage, but it also kind of seems good. All right. Seven, this and this. That certainly is like every orb card on the game. Okay. I could use some channeling. The ability to actually channel an orb could be helpful. Hey, more focus. We'll take it. Um I don't really have the ability to channel an orb right now. Makes fission plus a worse card. I guess I am taking hallways over question marks because cool headed. Feels like a really good card. Also turbo. You passed a glacier? Yeah, I got a card remove. Okay. FTL for the very, very short infinite. It's an option. Heart's fine. Do the archer thinks the 33 months? Infinite is an oxymoron. Agree to disagree. 
Who is infinite for sufficiently small values of infinity? Darkness. All lightning. All lightning is also fine, I guess. Uh, I don't think I need double self repair, but I'm not actually certain that that's true. I think I'm good. I think this is. I think I'm fine. Double self repair then. It should be all right without it. You again. Gambling chip would have been pretty good there, huh? FTL. The end of the short internet. It did its best. Four against thirty five. Who a toxic egg? So Storm's kind of good here, right? I have one, two, three, four, five powers and efficient. I think we take it for the yeah. <laughs> well, for the effect that it has. <laughs> I thought that was gonna be more profound. <laughs> Sorry. Uh White noise. Really use a cool headed plus. I don't know if I upgrade it. I was going to upgrade Zap. Just upgrade Zap. The energy runic pyramid thing. I don't really want to take more energy as a boss relic either. White noise is another power for a storm. You're right. You have successfully read what white noise is.
Fuck it. Can't be played a war. You seen Tori Tungsten take a zero from early heart multi attack. That's how it works, yep. That was also how people on chat said it worked. Amplify plus. Is it good? Hope so. Not inserter. Fusion hammer? Fusion hammer is okay. I have a toxic egg too. I don't really need more powers. I'm mostly going to be adding skills to the deck, I think. Yeah, seems good. Two more removes. Two more shops. I think we take the right path, though, because I want hallway fights for cool-headed plus and turbo plus. How does this beat time eater? Yeah. That's a good point. Good point. I guess I could have stacked Panda a bit there. Why wouldn't this be Time Eater? Ah, uh, it would. It was a yoke. Played loot for it. Probably should have played loot. Yeah. I wonder if I just have lethal. Actually, now that I've started using potions, I've looked at my hand and it kind of feels like I do. Alright, cool. I just didn't want those potions.
I guess that was the wrong order. Oops. Lost me six health. Nice. Fourteen, twenty-two. Okay. You're willing me a mummified hand? Thank you. I appreciate that. What have the rest of you done for me today, Twitch chat? Played the game for 230 hours and never played another character other than Charles Lightning. Charles Lightning is a good one. Forced Parasite Curse. Alright. Yes, ah, thanks for the 31 months. Yes, that counts. I appreciate it. Thank you. I just gotta take a reinforce body, I think. Having a big block card seems related to my interests, based on how things have been going. I didn't know that, Twiggy. Thank you for uh, letting me know, though. I could count, would I really be a Twitch streamer? Like, surely I would do something else with my life. I found a Seek Plus. Man. I do have two shops at the end of the act. Do I need to play more than three cards a turn? I have a Gambler's Brew. Man. Um... Probably the weird thing about this is that it doesn't do anything. Like, if I just remove these three cards, my deck already just wins every fight in the game. So all it does is force me to have two normalities on my deck through these fights. And one there. Doesn't seem very good. Alright, let's just do this then. That? I mean, who's even saving for retirement at this point? Let's be real with each other. Plus. I think that's actually pretty good. I think that is kind of the exact thing that my deck needs to be able to do. Channel a couple more orbs. I already have where I've seen all the good shop relics. Uh, I haven't seen orange pellets. So I do not agree that that is true. Never played on the 401k Ascension.
Ooh, some lifting, maybe? I actually have two campfires. I can't upgrade at them. Speak for... It's just... Well... Okay, there are options, actually. I'm gonna go Storm... Fishing. Act 3 Barrage incoming? I don't think so. Hey, Al Capone! Can Zephyr bunch and cat yells bench objects? Is that a thing? I bet I can bench at least three plates. Sure, we'll go with that. Um, four, seven, ten, thirteen. Probably not quite a genetic algorithm. I could take double energy. I think double energy has enough potential upside. Find an ice cream. Find a calipers. The storm has been so incredibly good. Like, wow. It's been a good storm. There's a turbo. I don't think I need it anymore. Discard remove. My Sunder is going to deal so much damage. FDL, as it were. The storm actually just has no chill. Very impressed by the Amplify, too. Multicast plus. Might do something. Consume plus. Consume plus might do something. I only have two orbs. Uh, <laughs> two? Ten. I only have ten orb slots. That is more than two. I think we just take Incense Burner. Just take Incense Burner and put it on four, and we win. Seems right to me.
Run has not had a lot of uh, frost orbs in it. Amplify double loop double self repair. And then maybe just core search. Four seems like a lot. I don't know about that shit. To seek amplify double play e frag so it doesn't matter if I play storm now or not what do you think is gonna happen here Zephyr I want instance burn run five ish or something. I don't know. We have to play Chaos Zap Dual Cast. Do you see? These zappers can I bunch? I'm not gonna tell you that because I feel like it would embarrass Zephyr about his weight. I don't actually know what I bunch right now. It's probably like 75 pounds. I don't think I bunch much at the moment. Round Soxing's for 13 months! Has been a while since last time I <laughs> exercised in any way. I like the FTLs are really bad this round. They will let me turn against the Act 4 elites. And that'll be kind of the only thing that they do, other than getting in the way on my fishing turns.
want this fight over in two turns. Wonder how I do that. So I want to play dual cast, but also... I want to be at full health. Alright. Okay. Not bad for a fair run, after that silent run. I might as well just have three strength. I don't know. Pinching is about spreadsheets. Interesting. I got a six skin plus. Seems like the thing the deck needs. Ow. Maybe wrong to play cards in case I want a Gambler's Brew for more than six. All right, I have uh, Intangible. <laughs> yeah, I knew that. I guess I play this now for potentially one health. I've still never generated a Frost Orb. Okay. Let's discard six. That? I mean, <laughs> this is pretty, pretty atrocious. Uh, good now. Turns out that there are good cards in my deck. dealt slightly too much damage. Whoops. It's okay for this to be on one, but it's not preferable. I gonna do realistically I can get it to two but that's even worse right I want it on three or four or zero or one uh I don't have loop This is unfortunate. I guess I want to miss this. Good luck. Oh, I hit it. All right. We're gonna do it without incense burner.
This is losable now. Like, I have kind of fucked up. Haven't ever generated a frost orb with chaos. What is eight times six on AOI? I don't think anybody knows. It looks like I'm not dead. Yet. I think it's 54. Probably within an order of magnitude of that, I guess. This is one of those things that nobody knows. Do you want loop on play? I want to get through my deck. A lot of stuff I want here. Turbo would kind of be better than double energy. We knew turbo was good. Core Surge Loop Gun. And I think I stopped taking damage, probably. Of dreams, six and forty four months. Appreciate it. Everything about this is fine. It actually is. I'll set this on. Have to get another frost door to the front. But 
but I think I can do that. Full cool headed, defrag, defrag, zap darkness. Am I one short? Maybe one short. Can I end turn here? Doesn't look like it, right? I'm no longer one short. And there's no void. Who do you think you are? I am. GG. Damn, this game is easy. Yeah. <laughs> it would have been easier if I used the instant spurter properly. <laughs> Watch your win in or run to the bathroom. <laughs> 